Hi, my name is Marjorie O'Toole and I'm the Executive Director of the Little Compton Historical Society. And today we're on the other property that the Historical Society owns, the Friends Meeting House. And this is on West Main Road. The street number is 234 uh, West Main Road and um, parking is in the front and people are welcome to come and walk the property. Um, the house is, or the meeting house is locked unless we have programming going on. But the Friends Meeting House was established by the local Quaker community around 1700. It is the first building built exclusively for worship in the town of Little Compton. It's important to remember that in 1700, Little Compton was part of Massachusetts Bay Colony, not Rhode Island. And so technically, our colonists did not enjoy the privilege of religious toleration that Rhode Islanders did. But because Rhode Island was so close to us, just across the Saconet River, and because we were so far away from Boston, uh, and because time had passed, Quakers were safe here in this community. Um, the Rouse family lived very nearby. Uh, members of the Rouse family had been beaten in Plymouth just a generation before because of their Quaker faith. So at times it was truly dangerous to be Quaker in New England. But by 1700, and certainly in a place like Little Compton, they were relatively safe. This is not the first building that the Quaker community uh, or the Friends built in Little Compton. The first one was smaller on this site um, and it was destroyed in the Great Gale of 1815. So what we see here today is what that community rebuilt after that storm. It looks much like it did in 1815 over the years. Uh, the the society had added onto it. They had added an entryway and made a few changes. When the Historical Society was given the property in the early 20th century, um, those additions were taken away, actually in the mid 20th century, by our executive director, Carl Brownell, who tried to restore it more to its true 1815 appearance. In true Quaker style, it's a very simple building. You'll also notice that there are two doors. The door on the north side is for the men. The door on the south side is for the women to enter. And that was a sign of equality between the two genders in this religion. 